Hello, my name is Siobhan Sweet and welcome back to my kitchen. So today I am using the fabulous Biscoff paste, making these gorgeous lollies. How fabulous do they look? Um, so yeah, if you like Biscoff, you're gonna love this lesson. Let me show you how. So we're just gonna add the double cream, 225 grams of double cream into the machine. And we're gonna add 198 grams of condensed milk. And then we're just gonna whisk that together. to thicken up you're just going to add your biscoff and just blend that round pop that into your piping bag so we're just going to put these lolly sticks in here now these molds i've got from amazon they're really good like a rubber mold and we're just going to pipe in the mix now if you just do it from side to side that'll get rid of the air and i push the lolly sticks in at the end now if you notice it's got bits in it and it's because I'm using the crunchy Biscoff rather than the smooth. I just think it gives a better flavour, a better finish to it when, it's, when, you, when you bite into it. So I've got about half the mix left and these lollies are quite small, but to be honest, you don't need a lot when you eat these when they're finished. So I'm gonna pop that in the fridge. That'll last for a day. So once I've turned those out later, I'll refill the moulds. So they're going to go into the freezer for about four hours or overnight, it doesn't matter. And then I'm going to show you once already how to dip them. These are set nice and firm now so we can pop them out. So put your fingers behind and just push them out. And just push the stick up that way. They come out really easily out of these moulds. And then we're going to place them onto a sheet of paper. So I'm going to pop those back in the, in the freezer just for five minutes where I get the topping ready. It, that's a uh, grease proof paper or silicone paper. Um, so it'll just come off in a minute. So for the best bit, the outside, I've got um, 300 grams of white chocolate and I've got some Biscoff, uh, 150 grams. I've just put that into a bowl. I'm just going to melt that. Now, I don't want to get it too hot just until it's melted and I use the microwave to do that. So once that's nicely melted, we're going to pour that into a glass. Now I've chopped some lotus biscuits, these little biscuits here, and um, just because I like, I think it looks nice on, on the top, a nice little effect. So take one of your lollies, just dip it down. Take it out, let that drain off a second. That is it. How it's so simple, isn't it? And then before it sets, I just sprinkle a few little crumbs on it. just to give that a nice effect. So you can do these in any flavoured chocolate. If you do dark, I've done some lovely dark ones. I add, so it's 200 grams of dark chocolate. I add 10 grams of oil to it, just because dark chocolate can crack if you freeze it. So a little bit of oil will stop that uh, cracking. If you do milk chocolate, I would just um, add five grams and same with white chocolate. So you don't have to do this topping, you could do any topping, but I just think it looks nice. fabulous Biscoff ice cream lollies. If you like Biscoff, look at my YouTube video, Stuffed Cookie Biscoff, lovely. So these won't last for long, I can guarantee that. Thank you very much for joining me. Put the thumbs up if you like it and I'll see you on the next one. I've got a job to do to eat these now. Bye for now.